Welcome back everyone, it's Randy. In today's video, we see some significant changes that took place over the weekend as well as today. We get a good look at a lot of the new materials that have been delivered to the site, as well as excellent progress made on the south end, which now shows the large concrete column has been raised. I also take a quick look at some of the green vegetation we see in the retention pond since many of you have been asking for a closer look. When getting up close to take a look, the grass seems to actually follow the patterns of the treads of the vehicles that have driven through it which tells us that the weight of the vehicles have pushed those seeds further into the soil and actually allowed them to grow at a better rate. Today's key takeaways are as follows. On the north end, we see how the grass in the shallow pond areas look, followed by a look at the metal trusses and decking material, the latter of which is both on the ground as well as on top of the metal structure and appears to be white in color. We also see the addition of another smaller crane, bringing a total to four just in this area alone. In the central section, we can definitely see a clear outline of where walls will go in the large section that has the connected footers of varying size that form the shape of a rectangle. Over on the west side, it's still all about the footers and the geopier work. Everything looks about the same over on the east side with the spreading of the base material in the switchyard area. On the south end, the new addition is the raising of the large column we've seen parked on the back of a truck for the past couple of weeks. The significance of this is that this will be the first of many columns used to hold the rails of the gantry cranes. These things are everywhere at Giga Berlin and there are also different variations of these columns depending on if they will connect exterior walls or not. Concrete is still being poured in some of the vertical columns and the entire center section looks to be just about finished having rebar installed. So we may see this entire area filled with concrete tomorrow. Just south of the batch plant, we now get a better idea about what's happening with the large white building. Demolition has begun and we can see pieces of it have been removed and are off to the side. Do you think they are just removing segments of the building that they for sure don't intend to use or will the entire thing be torn down? Let me know in the comments. As for the southwest side, I had limited battery power left and I just had a quick look to get a visual. I'll be sure to get a more detailed look next time, but things are still being cleared extremely fast as far as I could tell. If you're new here, please be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you want to be kept up to date with the latest content. If you enjoy it, please consider supporting the channel on Patreon via the links in the description or at the end of the video. Let's get to it, starting in about 10 seconds.